Hello and welcome back to the channel. We are in Ho Chi Minh City today and we are taking an epic food tour around the town. We are jumping on motorbikes, not driving, getting chauffeured around and this is gonna be amazing. Right now we're waiting for them, right here to pick us up. I'm very excited about this one. How about you, Shelves? I cannot wait. I hope we get to try some things that we have never tried before because we've tried a lot of Vietnamese foods. We so. did send them a list and yeah. I think they're being very accommodating today. Yeah. It is super exciting. My name's Chase. How about you? Happy. Happy? Nice to meet you later. My yeah. name is May. May. Yeah, you May. guys already know. Yeah. 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 And happy. <laughs> nice to meet you, okay, Nice to meet you. Feel free to ask me any question regarding our history, our culture. Yes. Yeah. All political matters. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you feel free to ask me anything. Even yeah. Happy's personal life. Yeah. Okay. Uh, why am I? Why am I even called Happy? Okay. Heads up! It's actually my real name. Happy. Yeah. That's a nice name. They name you Happy. Yes. <laughs> it's translation of my name. Okay. Yeah, his real name in Vietnamese. What's okay? First question. Why, why are you named Happy? This is my surname, my family name, yeah. Chun. Vân Phúc, it's my real name. Okay. Right? Vân Phúc. Yeah, Chun Vân Phúc. So people call me Vân Phúc or Phúc. Yeah. All my family call me Meow. 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 Oh. Because I was born in the year of the cat. I show you this name, Vân Phúc, right? And when I put it in the Google translation, it's turned to eternal Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Oh. I like that. I like that. Like a lot of is that common for a lot of um, no. Vietnamese people to have backgrounds like that? Right, no. No. no, you're just special. And yeah, mom had a thought out. Yeah, mom had a thought out. Mom thought of it all. You ready, chefs? Vietnamese food is ever evolving. Yeah. Every day. And it, the fact is that we have new variation of things all the time. And I'll tell you a bit of a story about the pho. Okay. Do you know? One thing, do you know who started the pho? No. The pho is the result of the French colonizing us. Okay. It's, I know the bread came from there. <laughs> yep. Yeah. The pho, how do I say this? So overall in Southeast Asia as a whole, in China, in agricultural kingdom, right? Yeah. We don't eat cow. Okay. For a very specific reason is that they're the plowing forces on the fields. Oh. Yeah, so yeah, like yeah. one cow, one buffalo can plow like 10 men. Yeah. So since our first official feudal king, yeah, we officially ban it completely. Oh, really? Yeah, we ban the consumption of um, uh, cows and uh, buffaloes. So like when you see Fa Bo, like there's a lot of beef around. Mm-hmm. That was the French. The French introduced us to like the process of cooking. Okay. Yeah. Even the name, if you go on Google, and I and there's a lot of reference when you search for the name of pho. Yeah. It's actually feu de pho. Okay. Uh, any French out there can verify the pronunciation because I butchered. <laughs> no worries. Pronunciation's very hard. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Electric bus. This one? Yep. <laughs> fully electric. Uh, fully electric. Yep. How many batteries do they need on that? I have no idea. <laughs> the whole, the whole bottom of it. Hello. Hello. Xin <laughs> chào. Xin chào. They have already ordered. We don't know what we're getting. Here. Um, well, we kind of do. <laughs> yeah. But basically, so this is the restaurant here, right? Yes. Yeah, here. Okay. Yeah. That is the restaurant name. There. No, right there. there. Right there. Right there. Right there. <laughs> I'm like, which one is it? So with this, you just take one of the plates. Yeah, you guys just take this one. Okay. okay this so you just yours. take, and this is a rice paper roll. Oh my god. This is uh, this is pickle cabbage. Uh, oh, pickle cabbage. Shredded that... mango, shredded like oh, cucumbers. Cucumber. This is a uh, how is it? A deep fried nim. Deep it's fried nim. Yeah, with yeah. cheese. With cheese. Is it pork? Yeah, it's pork. Okay, pork. So then that is this all pork? Mm -hmm. All pork. Oh pork. yeah, cheese. <laughs> cheese. Cheese. Wow. So this is pork in all different ways, and then you have like the um, pickled cabbage, the basil, cucumber, mango, and then all your sauces. So I think that we're gonna build one of these things and give it a give try. It, yeah, give it a roll. Yeah. Okay. See, I got my little. Looks and great. they also told us um, that typically you don't mix like two sour things. So like the green mango, unripe mango plus the pickled cabbage, you wouldn't want to put too much sour. So I didn't add the cabbage. And then you with your hands. I'm gonna do that too because I'm not great with chopsticks. And what did you dip yours in? This one. Okay. 
<laughs> I'm gonna dip it in the meat meat sauce. Yeah. And I'll take a bite. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Is it clean? Oh my god. That's incredible. You know what I'm really loving in there? What's that? The crunch from these little spring rolls. Oh, I didn't put the spring roll. I put more of uh, the cheese thing, this roasted pork, oh. and then this other thing over here. Mm. It's crunch, so good. Crunch, crunch. Yeah, so wow. don't need extra crunch. Can you get mm -hmm. spicy? Mm -hmm. This one. Mm -hmm. Okay. I love it. Dip into the sauce. Oh, yeah. So I'm going to dip into the spicy fish sauce now. And it's so good because you have like the crunchy little spring roll, you got the fresh herbs, you got the soft on the outside. It's literally like an explosion of textures to, and flavors. That one. <laughs> the spice that one. one. Oh my gosh. Phenomenal. They just taught us a really useful trick and these are the things that I absolutely love learning about. So you would dish up your veggies and stuff with the opposite end of the chopsticks and then you would eat with like the, what would you call it, the normal end of the chopsticks? Yeah, you rotate <laughs> it every time. So that every time that you're serving yourself up, you're, you're not yeah. contaminating yeah. and dipping back in. You're just using your end of your chopsticks to dish up all your veggies. So that way if you're sharing with a stranger, it's not like double dipping um but they you guys say with your friends and family it's fine you just use whatever end yeah, yeah. okay that's that's super good to know how is it cheese i've tried both sauces i'm loving the spicy we like the spicy the <laughs> spicy chili sauce wow this is great we're leaving our first place which was absolutely delicious what'd you think about it chelps <laughs> bye thank you that was like the best first food trip that we could have had. It was honestly, it was fantastic. <laughs> now we're on to the next. Yeah. So we are heading to get some, they're coconut pancakes, like coconut little pancakes. They just like, uh, how's it? Turmeric, coconut milk, coconut milk and uh, rice flour. Oh, perfect. Turmeric for some health benefits. Yep. <laughs> the streets have gotten a little narrower now. Oh, trust me, later it gets <laughs> more narrow. <laughs> later we're visiting one of the labyrinths. Yeah. How about I? How about I? Hello, Sen Chow. Yeah. Okay, you just yeah. stop on this side. Yeah. Thank you, bro. Woo! Woo! That's <laughs> stressful. We've had the Ban Sio before, which is like the big crepey pancake. Yeah. But this is like a little baby mini version. Oh, wow. Very delicious looking. <laughs> yeah, so that, oh, that looks so good. Right now we're having Ban Kok and Ban Kok. Yep, that's what we're having. And, <laughs> and that is her name right there. And she's this. This is for you guys. Oh, perfect. Wow, look at this. So shrimp. Oh Watch my goodness. Another car's coming, so. oh, and this is the lovely this is the creator. Hello. This, <laughs> yes, this is mustard leaf. The root of this thing, people call it horse, horseradish. Oh, we love that. And it used to make fake wasabi. Okay. Yum. Yeah, majority of it, like, is used to make wasabi. Okay. And what I do, okay, I'm just gonna, by accident, I break up the stem. But usually I keep them. <laughs> but right now, I've got handies out to you guys, okay? Okay. I'll go put this one here first, and I'll grab mine also. Now, what you do is that you shake up the water. Make sure it's not too watery. And then you plan ahead. You plan ahead means that you prepare the bedding like this, mm. in a way that you can fold it into a roll. Maybe I'll show chases. Hey, I'll, exactly. I'll... Oh, uh, Chase, you are actually the one person that should do it right the first time. <laughs> what about me? It's more like this. Yeah, have your thumbs up like that. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. I didn't do it right, guys. <laughs> Is that you, you have your favorite little mini pancake. Oh, that's so cute. And then you pop it right in the middle. Aww. Nice. Now what I do, okay, I think it's chopsticks. Yeah. Crush it. I got my pancake on there. <laughs> you crush it down. Oh. Like the oil, look at this. <laughs> it was like, oh yeah. You could, you could see it when they were being prepared as well. <laughs> and this, what you do, okay? You just tuck yeah. in and you break in. And this, like a little spine to help keep everything together, you see? Yeah. This okay. Is, I feel like that's not too bad. No, it looks great. Now, All right. the key to any Vietnamese dip, dip in, 
let it drip. Oh, shake it, it off and bite small. Okay. Bite small. small bites. Mm -hmm. What did you do this right now? Yep. Uh, Perfect. <laughs> so bite small, but then I'm only going to get lettuce. So I feel like I have to do a big bite. So you're opening it. What do you mean? <laughs> you're opening it so you can reel it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So first bite. Oh, it's just lettuce. Mm -hmm. Your first bite's lettuce? Mm -hmm. first if, bite if, if it's wrong. And <laughs> if it's rolled that way, I'm not a vegetarian, you guys. I'm a meditarian. <laughs> well, she went all in. No. Hey. Yeah, you have to turn back because this is the first bite. So you can't get the roll. Not even a little bit. <laughs> Dip and drip. Now we're going to go in the pancake. Here we go. This is a shrimp pancake bite. She's getting the full effects. Mm. Tell me, is it there? Mm-hmm. Mm. The silence speak a thousand words. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good. There, there's a lot of herbs in there. There's a lot going on. I taste so many herbs. The mint and then the pancake. To be honest, I didn't really taste much of the shrimp. It's like, it's not very fishy. It's very like, that's probably a good thing because it's good seafood. And then the pancake is like, I would say it mostly just feels soft in here. And then you get the crunch from the, the herbs, but it's really good. All right, off we go. Those were very delicious. And I think our next stop is not actually part of the food tour, but they asked if we wanted to go and buy it. And it's going to be a duck dip. Pepper roast duck. Pepper roast duck. Wow. And we're going to buy half of it. Yeah, because that's duck. huge. Yeah. We could not eat a full one. We wouldn't be able to fit anything else. <laughs> Half of it's still going to be huge. Look at those things hanging in the window. And it looks like they have a few chickens for you non-duck lovers. <laughs> Chase's mom. <laughs> You're watching. So we paid 170,000 like dong, awesome which is 10, 10 US dollars? Roughly, yeah. Oh, uh, no, less than. Less than. It, uh, yeah, I think 23 would be $10, so maybe even seven or eight. Yeah, seven. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah, come check it out. He was like, why are you stalling? Oh, <laughs> that's huge. Look at my hand, guys. This is my hand. You guys. Oh, wow. And then you got plastic bags. This is yeah, my gloves. hand. No way. <laughs> Let's get in there. I'll let you get in first, and then I'll try after. Okay. Wow. I'll give you your bag. you want? We're putting this on right now. What a unique experience. Very unique. I feel like all the other food tours probably would not be doing this. This was the duck's inside. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was the marinade that was pumped inside the duck. Wow. Okay. This looks delicious. And over here, you can come over here first. Don't worry. <laughs> you see the whole operation back there. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> so you can see back there, they have the ducks hanging right back there. That is a lot of ducks, you guys. That is a lot of ducks. Hi! <laughs> this is May. She's amazing. <laughs> All right. Okay, hey, dive in. The only thing that's better than this duck is probably me. Oh, <laughs> cheesy. What a sad. It's such a cheese ball. That's so cute. You ready, sweetie? I'm ready. <laughs> mm. Wow. That has a lot of like. I would say kind of a Chinese flavor, oh. like the five spices and stuff going on. That's yeah. very delicious. Oh my god. Mm. We got bone. <laughs> that is fan. That's amazing. The meat is very tender. 20 out of 10. <laughs> 20 out of 10. It's 20 all, out of 10. All yep. in that skin. So Happy just handed me. You said what mushroom? Wood ear. Wood ear. Oh! Mushroom. That's really good. I know. It's, it doesn't. Wow. It doesn't have the texture of a mushroom though. No. It's like a vegetable, but it, it's like soaked up all that flavor. The, the flavoring is even more intense in that mushroom. Okay, for the price, everybody needs to come here and get half a duck. Like it's yeah, so, yeah, yeah. It's so much meat. Now we are leaving, We're leaving Duck this. Street. longer till our next stop are we going for a quite a drive now we're gonna go in quite, uh, quite for a drive yeah it's gonna be a lot of scenery yeah yeah you're up for a treat for your eye <laughs> going around a roundabout so 
right here. Ah, oh, there's chickens. Chickens, dogs, you name it. That's where you get your fresh chicken. Wow. Some duck over here. <laughs> Looks a little different than the one we just ate. They have everything. And here's where you have to pick up something. Something you probably never had before. Oh, you got a lump, yay? Come on, yay. Xin chào. Xin chào. We getting off? No, no. We just buying just, a takeaway. <laughs> May just afraid of the sunlight. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we're having that one. <laughs> I have no idea what's the name. Oh no, we have a victim. Almost looks like a potato. <laughs> some say tastes like a uh, some say it tastes like a potato too. Yeah, yeah. But it's like really refreshing. Huh. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, the sunlight is purging me. <laughs> oh. By the end of this, we're going to be so tired. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I, I'm happy. I'm happy. Like, you get beautiful footage. <laughs> but my god. It's hot. I think it's about 36 degrees or more without humidity. So, probably in the high 45s or more oh, with man. humidity. Just so you know, that was all sped up footage and we were actually only doing 30 kilometers an hour. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Xin chào. Em ơi, hai ly nước ép đi, ba ly nước ép. Em hỏi thơm. They're just setting up. Ah, perfect. Perfect timing. They're just setting up shop here. And we're gonna get our pineapple and guava. Oh, my face. <laughs> oh, it's crispy. <laughs> Perfect. Now, before we have any of that, we're gonna have this one. Yeah. Some people say it tastes like a potato, and they kind of look like one too. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. Get off! Get off the bike and instantly food. <laughs> okay. And I'll show you guys how to have it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Shall be a fun view. Honestly, bro, what are you? This has been such a cool experience. Just like whipping around on the bikes, and May and Happy have been like the best tour guides that we could have asked for, like hands down. Yeah, and now we are out of the main districts where you would see any foreigners. Okay. Is that you take the tip, you buy on the tip, and then you peel it down. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, you just peel it. <laughs> you just spit it. Yeah, you did. You put it on the ground. <laughs> and now when everything's review, right? Mm -hmm. You bite to it. It's very good. I have to say, it's not in our culture to be spinning peels on the floor. It feels a little weird. <laughs> Every day, the vendors and everything they sweep this whole area. Really? Yeah. And everything that's biodegradable, it doesn't matter if it's on the floor. We noticed that. There's always a lot of things on the ground, and we're like, oh my god. <laughs> so, if you ate a potato raw like this, it would be very hard, but this has like softness and it has like an extra. What would you explain that flavor is? I would explain it. I would honestly explain it like a potato, but the texture is like the mix between a water chestnut and a potato. Oh, that's it exactly me of like a that, water chestnut. That's 100% right, and you didn't have to boil this or cook it. I did it. Oh, oh, they did? Yeah, they did. I was oh, like, I was like, That's I'm like, crazy. I'm like, this is crazy if it wasn't. Okay, it was boiled. It literally just tastes like a potato with a slight, slight texture of water chestnut. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. the texture I'd say. Okay, what is it called? Golum. Golum. How's that? <laughs> really funny name. <coughs> and it like has little itty, like almost like little potato hairs. It's really good. I like it. I still got peel in my mouth. <laughs> we just got our guava pineapple mixture. Cheers. 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 Oh. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. So, I had a really hard time removing my mouth from that because it is so refreshing and delicious. That? Yeah. Made me very happy, happy. <laughs> Whoa. 
do mix it up a bit. Yeah. Okay. Trust me, it makes it so much better. I'll be honest with you, I'm not a huge, huge like pineapple juice, pineapple on pizza, pizza pineapple girl, but this is so oh, it's amazing. good. It's almost like the guava cuts that really uh, bitter pineapple taste, exactly. not bitter, but sharp, and it makes the guava really sweet. On the nuts! <laughs> Oh, that's fishy smell. Yeah, Woo. fish sauce. <laughs> What's Ooh, that? Oh, I have no idea. <laughs> oh, the cutting, the cutting leather. Ah, smells synthetic leather. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Strong smell. I never seen that though. They never <laughs> do that there. Never. Right there they were cutting up some synthetic leather and they had some sort of something they were putting on it that had a very strong smell. Chicks. Stay off the road, you guys. Uh-oh. We have arrived and they are closed. You know, yeah. if, if, if there's one thing that we know about Southeast Asia, we know that this, is, this happens and it's common. I'm a little devastated, but there's nothing you can do. <laughs> so unfortunately, the noodle place that we were gonna show you guys is closed today, but we have made it to Happy, our tour guide's house. And this is where we're gonna try, I think it's like a homemade banana seed liqueur. Yeah. And then I'm not sure if they have the banana cake for us, but also this is a really local and authentic experience <laughs> that again, I don't think that you would get on any other tour. Like no. this is very personalized, so we're excited. Happy's family used to have a big salt business back in the day. And this oh, whole, still do. Still, still do? Yeah. Still do, but this used to be the storage all the way up into the roof. And this is huge. You can see where it covers? Yeah. yeah. So it would be right up to here. And I have to beg my mom to take it. She doesn't want to take a couch. She said like nobody. She doesn't want the couch because nobody sits on the couch. Nobody sits on the couches. <laughs> Even like men's no. house have wooden benches that are super nice. Rarely people just go sit there. I use no. that one to take my stuff and put on <laughs> <out> the <laughs> I'm shocked. So, so if you guys are in here, you're sitting on the floor all the time. Yeah, sit yeah. Or sit in here. This is just banana and bread. Just banana mom. and bread. Banana it's and kind bread. This is for like you, man. Banana bread. Oh, thank you. Okay. And May, this is for you. Please try to. And I got a banana like right in the bottom. You can see it. Mm -hmm. My mom is really, really good. Mm. She can make. There's no sugar. Oh wow. There's no sugar. In no sugar. That's all from no the sugar. plantain. Yes, yeah, it's from a plantain banana. Mm. That is so, so, so it's, good. It's so sweet, and I love sweet dessert. I'm shocked that there's no sugar in here. <laughs> no mm. sugar. Guaranteed. It's really moist, like super, mm -hmm. super moist. Oh wow. That right there is a little slice of heaven, everyone. And then you you get like the like the brown charred, not charred, but like kind of crispy bottom that also has so much flavor. Wow. Like, did this sing? Was it making it noise when it's tall? Oh, how many brothers do you have? Oh, that's oh. <laughs> So this little dessert or snack tray, literally, is that for Elise or something? What yeah. is the song? <laughs> it, it sings to you and I like it. I want someone to sing okay. to dessert. So we were trying one of these little things? These? These are like uh, sugar glazed lotus seed. Lotus seed. Soft? Not for me. Yeah, I don't know. It almost tastes like a sugar bean or something. Mm hmm. This is a jam. A, a, a jam? This is like a coconut jam. A coconut jam. Yeah. Hardened. Oh, that texture. It very is good. fun, right? That's a fun texture. Yeah. That's very good. Tastes like a sugar cube. A sugar cube with an interesting texture. <laughs> okay. What the? <laughs> <laughs> Shelby was like, what? Woo! <laughs> grapes. Oh, grape, okay. Yeah, grape. This is rice liquor. Okay. It's been um, inside, sitting inside of it. It's dry, seeded banana. Wow. This banana has more seed to it. Okay. It has tons of big seed. And what people do is that they dry the banana and they crush them, they flatten them, and then they it's, they, put, they soak them to, into the rice liquor. They dry them and they flatten them, and yeah. they soak them in it, rice liquor. Rice liquor. And then that's it, and it let off endlessly amount of good flavor that just tastes just like whiskey. Mm -hmm. Does it taste oh. like whiskey? <laughs> I don't like whiskey. Well, you're gonna try this one. <laughs> we'll see. I maybe like it. Maybe I won't. We'll see. Okay. Malt. Hi. Hi. Bye. Bye. Yo. Yo.
<laughs> oh. <coughs> that is like a whiskey, yep. <laughs> Good night again. Yeah, okay. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh my god. Oh, it does taste like whiskey, yeah. Yeah, that's wonderful. That's rough. <laughs> oh, yeah. I won't. Okay, his mother made amazing banana seed liquor. <laughs> How does the alcohol lover like it? Like, you like whiskey, right? Oh, I'm not too much of a fan of whiskey, Ooh, but this was really nice. Like, I've had, strong. I've had really intense whiskeys and scotches at home, which I probably would, would, would go for the sip of water. But okay. with this one, I can just. Nice. I'm not a whiskey, nice. I'm not a whiskey lover, and that nice is nice and warm Ooh. and enjoyable. Exactly. Yeah. This is our next stop, and we're having jellyfish. <laughs> this is the jellyfish. And he puts that just right in the soup. Yep. It's a topping. That's cool. Very cool. Uh, it looks so good. And then of course you have all your classic condiments, your chili, your lime, uh, and then what is this? This is a. Uh, this is Kind of like a substitute to the chili oil. Looks like almost lemongrass. This is lemongrass chili oil flake. That looks like lemongrass. <laughs> I don't think we've seen this before. You eat part of your soup, you'll be happy. Ooh. I'm already happy smelling it. Happy. I don't think we've seen this before yet. No. Nope. Yeah. And what is this one? This is a. That's mum dog. Oh, <laughs> I, I could tell. I could tell. <laughs> Yeah, some shrimp the paste shrimp or say I it. swore I'd go <laughs> right at the last minute. Like, oh, <laughs> even when I looked at you, his mom Even when I looked at you, your face was like. <laughs> 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 yeah, this is. I don't, I don't drive. <laughs> they already know that. I don't drive with the shrimp paste. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so we have got our soup now, and it has. Looks like coriander, looks like shallots. The some, jellyfish, some tofu maybe. Um, maybe some pork, different different types of pork you can see in there. Mm -hmm. And then the looks, jellyfish. Looks like some tofu or something. Maybe. Yeah. What is this one? Is that to what is this? Now that's fish cake. Fish that's cake. the reason why we're here too. It's really good. <laughs> I promise you, if you dislike like fish overall, you'll love fish here. Okay. Everything we'll see. Fish. We'll Very see. Good. And then they give you this which almost always comes with this dish. And it's like a, kind of like a sweet chili calamansi kumquat sauce. I just want to try the jellyfish okay. straight up. Same here. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's slippery. <laughs> it's crunchy. <laughs> it's very, very crunchy. I feel like I've had something like it before, but I don't know what. It's like a chicken college. Oh, that's what it is. Yes. <laughs> it almost tastes like a chicken cartilage with, with like the taste of squid. Yeah. 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 I'd say so. All right. Do you want to try it? Feed me, darling. I'm the worst at this. I like that. That oh. broth is amazing. You got the wind in your hair. You got the <laughs> That is so good. The fish cake. It's good. It's good. I'm this, not a fish cake girl. This broth is amazing. Mm -hmm. Holy smokes. The broth is it's just it's just like a clean yeah, it's a clear very, like chicken soup broth. Is that a fish cake for me? You wanna try the fish cake? Here I'll right. let you. I'll do this <laughs> left-handed. Yeah, this two is like super different. Jellyfish is better. This is fish though. This is kind of oh, like that's fish too. sausage with pork. Yeah. And then with wood ear mushroom. Oh, oh okay. that's some more wood ear. Yeah. We had wood ear at the duck place. I'm really good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's really good. That's really good. There's also fresh fish in there and once you add like the cabbage, the bean sprouts, we added a little bit of this like lemongrass mixture and it has the rice noodles. It's honestly so, so good. It just keeps getting better and better. I could totally eat jellyfish again. Off we go. You thought uh, we've eaten a lot and you think the food tour would be over, but no, no, no. Off we go. And we are heading to a special spot. They haven't told us much about it. I think we heard there might be some fish involved, feeding, whatnot. And then we still have dumplings 
and who knows what else. Traffic jam. Yeah. This is so funny. <laughs> this is very good. <laughs> it's getting busy now. Oh yeah. yeah. Right once the sun goes down, everyone comes out to play. This is definitely a once in a lifetime experience. Food tour and driving around on the bike in Ho Chi Minh City. All the shebang all together is super amazing. <laughs> Traffic jam! Oh, oh boy! <laughs> Here we go. Bring the knees in a little farther. Yep. <laughs> Here we go. This is absolute madness. <laughs> nice to see you girls again. <laughs> this is uh, insane. Yeah. It's awesome, right? No. They would not want to be with me. So they wanted to surprise us with this place and it looks so beautiful. And apparently it's a nice relaxing place where you can like get a drink, you can get beer, coffee, feed the fish, so... Let's get to it! <laughs> wow! Oh my goodness! <laughs> I've always wanted to sit in these tables! <laughs> oh my god! What a drink! <laughs> okay, shut up right now. <laughs> if this isn't just absolutely perfect, we are getting to nearing the end, so this is just a nice wind down. There's fish everywhere. <laughs> I have always wanted to sit in a table that oh, was in a pond. It's perfect. He probably jumped over how fast he got it. Did you just... <laughs> yeah. Don't ask why. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, this is cool. There's so many in here. What is this place called? I didn't even catch the name. Secret place because when secret. you try wait when you found a pool tour. Okay, we okay. It's secret guys, so we won't list this one. You have to book the tour. <laughs> no, just kidding. This thing we call the King Koi Coffee. They probably would have saw that when we walked yeah. in <laughs> anyway. Yeah, the name is over there, so that's yeah. why I, I wonder why you asked me. So we just got our drinks. I got a coconut. Chase, what the heck did you get? I know. What is this? <laughs> a monstrosity. These are so cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, I need to try that even though it's a beer. You got coffee? Yeah, let's say coffee with condensed milk, but less condensed milk. And nothing for you? I love freebies. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like Chase. Wonderful. Best friends. Best friends. Okay, let's see. I got the passion fruit mint beer. Oh wow. It needs to be stirred, babe. You always do that. <laughs> so it's good. I gotta see, feed the fish. Well, that's really good. And then they got like a syrup at the bottom, which I haven't got yet. <laughs> oh, they have cottage cheese. Hmm? It's like a cottage cheese ball. Like. What? <laughs> cheese. <laughs> There's oh, no, the apple. Cheese. Oh. One look, cheese in, go crazy. Well, It looks like a cheese almost. Yeah. An interesting drink, to say the least. So you guys, I'm really <laughs> sensitive to beer, and I'm like, Chase, this doesn't taste like beer, and I flip the bottle around. It's a strong bow. It's a strong bow. <laughs> There's no beer in it. I don't know why uh, they call it uh, passion fruit mint beer. It was, I don't know, I probably misread it. I just saw it when we were walking in, and I had to get it. What are you girls doing? <laughs> I made a friend. <laughs> I'm sharing the pellet. Well, I'm sharing Chase's pellet. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. These fish are so amazing. Not a shortage of fish. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> so we spent quite a long time in that koi fish place. Ooh, it was just so fun. Vietnamese roundabout, everyone. There's Shelby and me. <laughs> Leading the pack now. <laughs> Hold on, girl! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> 
<laughs> so Shelby's just collecting her thoughts there after that ride. That's freaking scary, man. It's freaking scary. <laughs> Like the, the traffic and the driving here is up, it's no joke. No, it's There's not. people everywhere. <laughs> it's wild out there for sure. And we're like literally right beside the roundabout we just went through, about to get some corn. <laughs> I'm like, just need to calm down. Shelby's like, I'm not hungry anymore, my stomach. I'm just gonna walk home. <laughs> <laughs> She's frying up some corn. Dried little baby shrimps. Yeah, we got baby shrimps, corn. Is this two different types of corn? It's got some yeah. chives. This is the uh, glucose. Is that corn. the yolks? Yeah, that's the salted egg yolk. Salted oh. egg yolk. This is true street food right here. Oh, <laughs> yummy. So I don't even know where we are or what intersection we're in right now, but what is this dish called? Bap sao lung moi. Sweet corn with salted egg yolk. Okay. Stir fried sweet corn with salted egg yolk. That's have... krills. Wow. Krill. Oh, it's krill? Yeah. Oh, so there's little baby things. They're not shrimp, they're krill. They're krills. Oh, I always thought they're little baby shrimps. Oh. Mm. <laughs> mm. And that's steaming. Okay, look at that. It's really hot. I don't want to burn my mouth. Watch out for the sauce at the bottom, too. You might get your white yeah. shirt. <laughs> oh. Spicy. Well, they got the chili, chili sauce, right? Mmm. We can make this anyway. Oh, just egg. Mmm. Like, oh, it's your favorite thing. I don't go sweet with egg that much. Oh, that's so delicious. Oh, yeah. The corn is sweet. She added a little bit of sugar. And then you get the taste of the little baby krills. And it's super buttery. And then there's spice in there. It's really hot. Oh, that it was good, right? Yeah. That's fire. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. That is so delicious. Yeah. This corn is an absolute must-have if you guys can find it. Oh, they might. So, next destination: snails, some deep, donuts, and deep fried dough ball first. Deep fried dough ball first. Woo wee! Arriving at our next destination. I see donuts. <laughs> this is a pate and this is a orange egg custard. Okay, so this is, oh, they're filled. So this is pate. <laughs> and what kind of pate? Liver or pork? Liver pate. Liver pate. And then that one's a. Uh, it's a Chinese egg custard. Chinese egg custard. With <laughs> orange juice. Oh! This is yours. All right, pate filled bun. Yummy. <laughs> 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 Canada. 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 Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That side, yeah. Uh, oh, close, close. <laughs> a little bit far out. I don't know. <laughs> Very Let close. Yeah, Very yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, this is how we see. That's so cute. <laughs> Hello. What is your name? What's your name? Yeah. What's your name? Yeah. What's your name? Uh, my name is Home. Home. Oh. Uh, Shelby. 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 <laughs> nice to meet you. Uh, you're right, guess. Oh gosh, my age, Anna! Oh. <laughs> We're playing the age game again. <laughs> my friend, uh, how, like, uh, you're right, you're right. I'm a. You're right, you're right. I'm a little girl. Twenty. You're my new best friend. Uh, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I'm not <laughs> I, I love him. <laughs> Chase, awesome. I'm sorry I married Chase him. Chase, you have a competition. See you again. Bye. Bye. Oh, sweetheart. Oh, my God, my heart. Well, never mind the donut. I forgot I had it in my hat, he which is not like me. He helped us cool down a bit. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, now okay. it's like perfect. So good. So good. Um. Look at over there. Over there. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's what we're eating. <laughs> the pate in there is like so soft and it's liver, but it doesn't taste like liver. I'll say this. 
I don't like regular liver. That's not pate, but I love liver pate. And the dough is like, oh, there's crispy on the outside and soft and fluffy on the inside. Yeah. Mm, what do you think? That was so insanely good. And look how much love and care goes into it. You don't let it sit still at all. Got to keep it moving. It's so nicely seasoned too. And obviously this is more of a savory type of donut. Mm. The dough almost has a hint of sweetness too. Mm -hmm. This one's a bit easier. Oh, wow. sweet donut if you're going for a sweet one go for this one if you want savory go for the one we just had the pad tape this is something that probably a lot of uh, Cantonese out there they would know this is bun ball oh it's uh, basically it's a coconut milk with sugar and with rice liquor as a binder oh so it's very good uh -huh. this is a new one for us <laughs> now we only good. know things that are panned in like that yeah I love anything coconut Love it. So this is for you. Just grab it like that. <laughs> very jiggly, jiggly. Oh, it smells like a uh, putty. <laughs> it smells like whiskey. Oh, does it? It smells like putty. <laughs> Let's try it together. He's like, smells like whiskey. I'm like, smells like something on a putty. All right. Let's go. I'm scared. It's like jiggly. Interesting. That's an interesting one. <laughs> More of just a uh, texture and not too much flavor. It's and like really jelly almost mm -hmm. and it tastes like almost like a little like fermented rice wine. It's, it's from the alcohol that is used to bind this. Rice wine and then it's just really sweet. Not, not my fave. Me either. <laughs> Off we go. Full of desserts, savory and sweet. All right, this is our next stop. Just gotta find parking and all this madness. Oh, wow. There's so many. Oh my God, <laughs> dude. That's all the sweet bowels right there on the wall. Oh, wow. On the corner on one side, that's all the savory ones. Okay. I'm gonna actually buy three bowels for you guys okay. and made a try. Okay, perfect. Yeah. You know what's good, so yes. we trust you. <laughs> you can trust me on bows. <laughs> oh, I love bow buns. They're so, ah! Oh, oh my God. <laughs> alcohol. <laughs> I just got sprayed. Like, pretty, pretty good. That's a lot of Never know, you need a little hand sanitizer. Oh yeah, we need that. <laughs> yeah, I could use that. Ooh. Look at this spray that went on Shelby's, Shelby's back. <laughs> oh, man. how freaking good it looks. <laughs> da -da -da. Oh my god. That bow is so fluffy. And the duck inside, you guys. It almost tastes like it's been like cooked for hours and hours and hours. It's like so tender. It's so sweet, the sauce, and it's really peppery. So Pumpkin much. bat, what did you think of the duck? Did you like it? It's pretty good. Yeah, it's really peppery. It is. I'm getting that pepper. Oh, yeah. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah. Can you smell it? I can't can smell it yet. smell it? Oh, it smells it so smell like good. Heaven. <laughs> it smells like buttery. <laughs> I don't really smell the pumpkin, I just smell it being buttery. I'm just getting all a bunch of pepper grounds from that last one, one second. I know, maybe we should have wanted All right. Yours. Cheers. Oh, it's hot. Mm. Okay. Ooh. Hot custard. Mm. It tastes exactly how you would expect it would taste. A, sweet, a sweet pumpkin inside. 
This one's pr pr pretty sweet for me. It is. I love it. I am. I feel like I give it like maybe, maybe it's a six out of ten. It's not my favorite. It's like almost pumpkin pie flavoring in the side. Like the, the filling is like whoa sweet. Okay, here like we go. A little uh, cupcake like bow. That's so cute. This is the hardest part. I don't want to ruin it. It's, it's okay. Outside. We know what it looks like now. <laughs> it now for the for the filling, I have no idea what is the filling's about. Mm. It smells like oh my gosh, flour. So weird. I don't know what it's almost. Sa Does it smell savory? I feel like it won't be savory, but <laughs> it won't be savory. <laughs> Like cheese, yeah. It does smell like cheese. It is cheese. Wow. Oh, what, what, what the hell is this? What, what is it? This one. It that is, is cheese. like the best, weirdest flavor combination. That's the weird. Oh, oh. oh, it's like sweet cheese. <laughs> like, so I nice. never had like. You know what it's like? like <laughs> have you had macaroni and cheese? Yeah. It's like sweet mac and cheese. That is so good. It's so good. <laughs> sweet cheese that is, is so actually. Out of place. Oh my god. <laughs> Well, the bow buns are a hit. That's Very one of good. my favorites. Very good. Very odd. That's fine. <laughs> you can't taste the charcoal. I think everyone's dancing with that one. <laughs> you can't taste the charcoal, but it's just like a sweet bun and then sweet cheese. That was probably my favorite one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know what? I'll say that one's the winner. Yeah. That one's the winner for sure. Yeah. This is the bun place that we were just at. The charcoal cheese one. Oh man. Oh so, man. So good. Oh. <laughs> Cuties. Ew. Two dogs just sleeping together there. He's taking us down this dark alleyway. <laughs> We've left the bikes behind and we are going to what is it the world or the biggest food court in Ho Chi Minh here? Yes. The biggest, it is. Food, court. The biggest food court in Ho Chi Minh City. <laughs> if you can believe it, it's down this alley. <laughs> is that where this is down here? Yep. Oh. <laughs> I've got dribbles on me. Yeah. You can take the bigger road, but these are the walking paths. Wow. I like the walking paths. As long as there's people. If I can see people around. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this just transformed. Oh wow. I want it. Where are you? Watch your yeah. Uh, we've eaten a lot of chicken feet. Yeah. <laughs> wow, this is just you're walking down a dark alleyway and then all of a sudden just boom in the middle of a market with, with bikes still going through. <laughs> so this market has just been going on and on forever. We've been walking for minutes down here looking for the perfect snail place. You guys, this market is the best market in Ho Chi Minh. What is it called? No clue. Cambodian market. Cambodian market? It's actually called Cambodian market. It's called Cambodian market? Canada. Yeah. yeah. So no, the cow. <laughs> Welcome to Vietnam. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay. This is basically we call snail them snail sludge. Okay. Snail sludge. <laughs> snail soup. Look at those little snails in there. I have no idea what it's called in English though. We call them upland, and they've been braising in coconut juice and yes. Vietnamese coriander. Now, <laughs> first thing you're gonna try, okay, okay. is the soup. You try to see. <laughs> From now on, recording is gonna be on this thing. It's so convenient. It's like a parachute. Oh my god. Yeah. Is it good? It is outstanding. It you, is know like... what, you know what it uses juice for? Stir fry rice. It's f oh, really? Stir fried rice? Oh, you... oh we need I to go to your, we need to go to your house. It's like a thick, sweet coconut milk soup. You just use your hand. It's a bit hot, but you can get it quick enough. Stick inside him out. Oh! And use your mouth to cool it down. Quick. Yeah. Cool it down with your mouth. Yeah. And then you suck on the one end. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh my like god! It. You know what? That's amazing. I get that one. 
You know it's good when Shelby can't go. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that that was gonna be a problem. And I was like, no, they all do it. <laughs> I just want to joke, I just want to deep go to the snail. <laughs> so, I ran into a problem. I, I don't think you heard. So I sucked, snuck, uh, sucked the snail Snucks. in my mouth. Yeah. And I basically almost like, <laughs> choked on it. <laughs> Is that ever happened? Or is that just me? I think that's just you. Just me, yeah. I, I figured. <laughs> okay, so now we got the, wow, those are huge. So remember the meat that we have, that's a booty mushroom oh, also? Oh, I see that, okay. Yeah. So we're gonna have this one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick a stick here, use my hand. Okay. And then I'll use like one of my thumb. I'm gonna hold the shell down. Uh-huh. And then I'm gonna use a lemongrass, okay? Oh. I got a little technique here. Ah. Just pull everything, just wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, 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 oh. wiggle. Oh, she's just bumming to show you. Okay, You're right here. This thing is smoking. That's, that's, it's smoking. That's snail. Yeah, it's like meat, a ground pork. Oh, and it makes the snail. And it, it, the snail is this big. It just chops up. Okay. Later we're gonna have this guy right here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Now, for this one, okay? We're just gonna have like a skewer inside. Yeah. And then we dip it. And Shelby, this is for you. <laughs> Enjoy, it's very good. Wow. It's delicious. Ta da! Is it tasty? So good. It's fantastic. <laughs> Snail definitely is chewier, it has more of a chew. Yeah. But this sucker is like loaded with lemongrass, the pork. Is yeah. like seasoned literally to perfection. <laughs> and the sauce, super sweet. And gar is it garlicky? The sauce, garlic. Garlic, chili. Garlic, chili. Come on. Come Yeah. Wow. It's like a snail lemongrass um, meatball. Yeah. That's what it tastes like. It's amazing with mushrooms. Ooh. Woo! Last year was the first time I tried snail, and it's not this is this is amazing. I was I was sleeping on the snails. Here, let me dump it a little better for you. Mm. <laughs> These are the little boys. This is Oppo. It's a river snail. It's the most common river snail. And yeah, you can get them anywhere. They're considered the lower end on the whole snail scene because of how okay. easy you can get them. Okay. Yeah. So, so like, what does that mean? Like the cheapest or? It's actually the cheapest, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So like if people want seafood, this is like the close, like the best bet <laughs> if you're on a budget. Yeah, but this thing is only, this is like for like uh, fresh water. So what I do is the same concept, okay? But this time I'm gonna go down. This I'm gonna go down big. right down here, okay? Wow. And then I'm gonna pry it. Oh no, actually this side is good. I'm gonna yeah. suck it in deep. And then I'm gonna there. pry it out. Oh wow. It's very hard. It's a good sign. It's a good sign. It's a good sign, why? Yeah. Because it's, it's a fresh. Good, good one. Oh. And this is fresh. Oh wow. Oh gosh, that's huge. There you go, Shelby. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da! Shall we? Is that supposed to look like that? Yes. Oh. <laughs> so you can have the bottom you like. If not, I can separate for you. I think separation would be fantastic. <laughs> <good. laughs> <laughs> only because all of that in my mouth at once is a little much. <laughs> I think that'd be a big bite. Yeah. I'm not opposed to it, but <laughs> that also looks like a fetus. <laughs> it's like a snail fetus. <laughs> I'm just gonna have this bite. Okay. What do you mean it's a man, right? Like it's a full grown man. <laughs> I have the school chase. Thank you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> up, up, and up, and about, up, and about, no. twist to twist, and yeah, this is a small one. Aww. Oh no, <laughs> little baby one. That's okay. So this one's for Chase. Chase. Dribble, 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 dribble. Is it? It's not. All right. It's very fishy, very river-like. Oh wow! You're drinking the river. <laughs> is that the word? No, it's not the taste that's like that bad. It's a little fishy, but it's the, it's slimy. 
and the texture is really like kind of chewy. It's, <laughs> you know what? Mm. It was the last time we had snail too, and I mm -hmm. still wasn't feeling it. I like the small snails, and I like when the snails mix with things, but big snails like this, that is not. What this I'm one doing. has like. What the heck? I know what's going on there. <laughs> That's the egg. Yeah, you got egg. It's a delicacy. You want to try? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. So that's lucky? Yeah. Very lucky. Very wow. lucky. This is so lucky. <laughs> so I'll try to buy her. You don't like it. <laughs> I can tell. But the first bite, I like it. I like it because I like fishy. Ugh. <laughs> uh -uh. All right. Now off to the last one. Okay. We're gonna have this is a little egg sack. Is that a lucky? No, thank you. That's a no. Thing. It's like it tastes like uh -oh. a fishy egg. It's like a fishy egg. So this is morning glory, and and this is so, this is bread, like stir fry in. Um, and tamarind. Here we go. Ooh, oh. Big boy. All right, sweetie. Yeah. Very good. Mm. Uh, different sauce. Mm -hmm. We're missing the green sauce. Dare I say what this looks like? <laughs> Shelby. <laughs> Look like me this morning. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's so good. Is it good? Okay. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Wow. What is going on with that sauce? What is that now? This is like a uh, green lime chili. Green lime chili oh sauce. Oh my god. When you didn't have the sauce, it was it was like a piece of like a seasoned clam. It was good. When you dip in that sauce, spicy. Oh, that is... Okay, well, I have to try that again. That's incredible. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's incredible. Oh, what? Lemongrass, hey, garlic, man, no, ginger? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Very good snails here. Wow. I could pass without the river snails, but you know, when you come here and try your own snails, you can pick whatever snail the you want. Snails are not for free. The snail lady gave us some for free. A fifth one, a different one. A fifth snail. So this is called rice snail by translation. They look like a smaller version of the river snail. <laughs> <laughs> dun dun dun. Watch, Shelby, you're gonna get an egg sack again. Lucky. I'm a lucky girl. It does look like <laughs> Have that. Thank you. You dip this in anything? Yeah, you can. Try the, the, the chili one. Yeah. yeah. The chili one's good. But you should try it without the dip first. Okay. Naked snail. Naked snail. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a Ross. Like Ooh. a chase for you. Okay. Naked, naked snail is not for me. Oh. It's just like a. Oh. What was that? <laughs> I got like shell and stuff. Oh. Or something. I got crunchy stuff. Oh, that's a shell. <laughs> I don't know about these rice snails, my friend. They're just like they're just like steamed snail. That's what they taste like, just steamed snail. Right? This is very organic. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a good way of putting it. It's very organic taste. It's so organic. <laughs> I made it the whole day without anything on my shirt. The last Thing that we eat, green sauce. <laughs> Thank you guys for everything. Like that was, we went, we did so much food. That was absolutely amazing. Yeah. Like, my tummy is happy. It's full. You know what's nice too? The portion sizing. That was really nice. We didn't get like a whole swack of stuff all at once. Because yeah. then I feel like we would be really full. But I'm actually at, like a really good fullness. Yeah. So that's awesome. Yeah. We're Yay! Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> And make sure, I guess we'll just kind of end the video here because it's probably getting too long already. But we will put, <laughs> it's gonna be a long video, but honestly you guys, we had the best day ever. Um, it's dark in here, but we will put all their information down in the description box below. Definitely do the tour. If you're in Ho Chi Minh City, you will not regret it. Thank you guys. Yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you okay. for doing everything. Yes. And subscribe and hit the notification bell and we'll see you guys in the next video.